It's now seven years since Maria Stubbings was murdered in her own home by her ex-boyfriend. Her daughter Celia says the domestic abuse began soon after the relationship started. She was contradicting herself in her behaviour. She was nervous. She wouldn't speak to her friends. She was very clipped in her responses. Everything about her just seemed to shrink and she was a shadow of her former self. She was normally very vibrant and confident and all of that just evaporated when he came into her life. Mark Chivers had already murdered a previous girlfriend, yet in spite of the danger he posed, an inquest into Maria's death found Essex police failed to protect her. They've now apologised. Now, um, you're not going to make a fool of yourself tonight, are you? Police in England and Wales will now be given specialist advice on how to spot the signs of domestic abuse. It's hoped this will mean officers can prosecute without relying on evidence from victims. We think this is going to be a big step forward. Um, it puts the tools in the police's hands, as long as it's implemented properly, for them to be looking for the right things when they go out to a victim's home, to the scene of a domestic abuse incident, gives them the right information to really look for what's going on in that home. Maria's daughter will never get over her mother's death, but as she's pleased, police attitudes are changing. When your mum gets murdered, you are on another planet for a very long time, and even though time is a healer, that, that inextricable link is just so strong that I just want to shine a light of, of compassion and change in her name and live, live my life to the fullest. In her honour? In her honour. Maria was failed by police, but it's hoped that with better training, more women like her can be protected. Leila Hayes, 5 News.